good morning welcome back to another video my name is ashton if you are new here and today i am finally going to the doctor since my husband is home i was finally able to get an appointment and we're gonna go together this morning it's 6 41 and my appointment is at 8 so hopefully we can get some answers okay mia you can go outside why is it so cold we just got out of my appointment it's what time is it it's late too it's 10. Yeah. We have been here for two hours. I had some blood work drawn. They are concerned about my heart again, which is weird because that hasn't really been a concern, but we have a plan in place now. So we, I have a follow-up appointment in a little over two weeks. I don't even remember what she said we're doing for that appointment. I don't know if you do. But anywho, progress. We are making progress. Felt yeah. a little bit better about your doctor than I think you thought you would. Oh yeah, I was really afraid that my doctor would just shove me off, but she was like genuinely concerned about the things that the hospital apparently was not concerned about because like my heart rate is in the 40s and apparently that's not normal. And like I knew that wasn't normal, but the hospital said, like the doctor at the hospital said that that was normal for me being an athlete. But like I don't really do cardio and it's low low and I didn't know that. Baby steps, baby steps. Now apparently we're going to get a burrito because somebody's starving. I brought snacks so we didn't have to buy anything. All right, we just got to the gym. We're having a little pre-gym snack. Portland's torturing me with a Subway sub. Can't tell you the last time I had a Subway sub. It sounds good. I am having some popcorn. I'm hoping this will help bulk up my stool a little bit with the insoluble fiber. Have you ever had a Papa Bulls chip though? I wanna try them, I haven't had them. But we were at the doctor's appointment a lot longer than I expected. Dang it, now I gotta call and make more appointments. I have to get, is it an e We did the EKG, right? Echo or? Yeah. Something for my heart. And then a new GI doctor and a nutritionist. I literally just wanna try these. Should I try barbecue or salt? Barbecue. Can you try one with me? Uh-uh. Is not healthy. Yeah, give me one. Tastes, even tastes good. It's just the cheddar, the you white cheddar back? popcorn. No, I don't. Okay. Want it. There's nothing wrong with it. Oh, that's not like healthy popcorn. No. No. Oh. oh, now it's good. Is that why no. you don't want my chips? You are think they, are they are, not healthy pop? No, oh. they're just pop. Seriously, they're pop chips. Why are you against healthy food? Are you dumb? No. I like popables. They literally taste like popables. Good. They're really good. I've probably eaten way too much for my body to handle right now. Okay, we are now leaving the gym to go back to the hospital to get a chest x-ray that I didn't know I was supposed to get, so that's cool. I'm glad we're still on base. I'm like half dressed right now. Be cute. Drive, 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 drive. Okay, we just got home from my x-ray and now I also have an appointment tomorrow for an echo. I think that's what my appointment's for. Something to do with my heart. But I did just get a Thrive box, so I think we should open it together because Thrive is exciting to me. I just love food. I love food. And, you know, having it come to my door is just, it's dangerous and fun. What do we have, what do we have, what do we have? Cute dark chocolate gems. These are paleo. That's cool. Canned salmon. Hold on. Mushroom jerky. This is really cool. Dried shiitake mushrooms. I'm excited to try that. Bloom superfood latte blend because I love chocolate and I'm going to make hot chocolate or like chocolate milk with it. Tapioca flour, which I've never used before. Oat flour. This is a staple. I've been dying to try this. I love spaghetti squash so much. And this is like dried spaghetti squash, I guess, like little snacks. I don't know. I'm so interested. I got two things of oat milk. They're cold. Makes me feel like I should go ahead and put them in the fridge. Almond 
flower, another staple. I'm really looking forward to trying these. They're sprouted oats. So hopefully they're easier to digest. And I just love oats. And this is something I'm excited to try too. It's the Primal Kitchen Vanilla Collagen. I've never tried this collagen before but I hope it's good because I'm almost out of my other one. And I don't really like the ancient nutrition one to be completely honest, it, it tastes weird. And that is all, burn baby, burn. Something so satisfying about eating fruit out of the fruit. Ugh, you just sneezed all over my forehead. Thanks. tired like I'm ready for bed but it's only 7.50. I am currently making Portland some stir fry. We have some leftover rice and we had some chicken that needed to be eaten. So I'm cooking up the chicken. I'm also prepping some chicken to cook tomorrow. I'm going to let it marinate in Italian dressing tonight so that we have a nice juicy chicken tomorrow. But I'm gonna make this and then probably go to bed soon after because I'm tired, tired like my eyeballs hurt. I have this puzzle going on right now. And it is the most boring puzzle. And it's so hard. But I can't give up on it. I'm not a quitter. Your food is done. It looks like mush. It smells kind of like a Chinese food restaurant in here. It looks really good. That's all I gotta say. Good morning, Mia. Pancakes. All the free chickens this guy got were roosters. Nice. <laughs> Can't do much with that. Hello. Sorry. Our kitchen look table at looks you with ridiculous. your with your beautiful breakfast. Yeah, it does look ridiculous. I've got to finish this puzzle so I I can clean it up. I don't like stuff on the table. All right, we're out and about again today. I want coffee so bad. I look like a hobo. I did not get things done this morning that I needed to get done. I tried, but apparently I have more to do. So that's cool. But I guess I'm gonna go in the gas station. We're at a gas station and see if they have caffeine I can drink. But it's always such a challenge to find something that I can drink because I don't do dairy and I really want something hot and everything hot has dairy. Trash, I might need money just in case I actually find something. Nothing. got shat on. I want to try this Luna bar. I've never had this brand before. Have you had this brand? Luna? I'm curious. It's got some good ingredients in it. Tastes healthy. Okay, I took one bite my stomach hurts. I look like I just rolled out of bed. I guess I kind of did. You ready to go in? Alright, we just got out of my Echo appointment and Apparently my heart walls are fine, like the muscular, oh, my heart. My heart being the muscle is fine. She said it was just like the electrical part of my heart is weird. And my heartbeat is in the 40s. I don't even know if I mentioned that, but my resting heart rate is like 40 something and that's not normal, not for me. So I don't know what to make of that, but I guess we'll find out soon enough. I have a follow-up appointment on the 11th with my primary care manager, so maybe she'll give us some information. So we're home, I'm showered, I've got the ultrasound jelly and sweat off my body and I feel much better. But I'm making some beets tonight, I'm gonna go ahead and prep them now and I'm not gonna cook them until later. I'm gonna roast them. I don't know if any of y'all have ever made beets, but Cortland came home from deployment and was like, I learned I like beets. So I think I'm gonna air fry them, see how they turn out. If you have any recommendations of how to cook beets, let me know in the comments below because I've never cooked beets before. I don't know if they're gonna be good or not, 
I hope they're good. I feel like anything in the air fryer is good, so I will let y'all know. But right now, I think the plan is to obviously cut this part and then peel it. And then I'm also going to cook this up for myself. I'm probably going to saute it because I like to eat as much of the produce that I can. Like even with a chicken, I use the leftovers for chicken stock because I don't like waste. As you can see, I've got my compost right here, which I'm going to have to go empty out in a little bit. But first I've got to clean these eggs that Cortland left. I'm cutting off the wilted parts because they're crusty and gross. I believe beet juice stains, so I'm gonna try my best to keep it off my clothes and my white counters. I don't know if I can do that because I'm just that person who makes a mess of everything. I feel like I'm having deja vu because I know this has happened in a video before, but I look out the kitchen window and my husband is cutting down a tree. I'm not gonna say anything. Also, he has, okay, so we're redneck, but he's trying to stretch out his watch strap. So this is his watch strap that he made and it's a little too tight. So he's like trying to stretch it out. I don't know, look at Mia, she's terrified. She's like, oh, dad's being weird. He's contemplating, oh goodness update the tree is down and well you can't hardly even see it i don't want to go out there because i don't want him to know that i'm watching him but the tree is down and the reason he cut it down is because it was hollow and i think he just wanted an excuse to do manly things and play with a chainsaw it didn't hit anything thank goodness i just want to point out that this tail on the beat looks like a rat tail and it makes me a little uncomfortable like, look at that you can't tell me that that doesn't look like a rat tail. If I cut it off right here and like stuck it up underneath the door frame, I bet Cortland would think there's a rat under there. Bees are such an ugly vegetable. Those are steamed. Cooked a lot like spinach, obviously. Taste test. Oh, it's really good. It tastes like spinach. All I put on there was salt, a little bit of salt. I wanna taste the stem. Wow, I actually really like that. And that's really weird. The stem is really good too. It's like an in-between of the beet, like the actual root portion and the leaf, which is weird. But wow, I'm actually quite impressed with how much I like this. Hmm. happy dance. All right, now I just gotta get rid of this water. Let that steam off. All right, I've got to put laundry in the dryer and put another load in the washer. Actually, I changed my mind. I think I'm gonna do more laundry on Thursday. Mia, babe, do you wanna come in? Are you scared? What's dad doing? What's dad doing, huh? Is he clearing out a space for chickens? I think so. Oh, I bet my, my thumbnail backwards. Holy cow. Ouch. I feel like I do that too often. I don't know what you want, Mia. What do you want? Do you want to go outside or like what's happening? I'm confused. I baked these beets instead of putting them in the air fryer since I had chicken in the oven. But it's the moment of truth. You wanna try one? Yeah. They're not as like roasted as I wanted. But everything else is ready to eat, so. I need more salt. Salt, salt, salt. Okay. They look so pretty. I need to cook longer. They're gonna be good.